and highly toxic plants. They're sprouting in mid Michigan. They're called giant hogweed and they're extremely dangerous just to the touch. Here's the thing. You may have it in your garden and you may not even know it. As Shannon Cantner reports, a family in Ovid Township got those seeds from a relative, which created a big problem. We liked it. It looked tropical. Little did they know the impressive plant can cause depressing damage. Just touching it could make you go blind. So we just said, it's got to go now. <laughs> They called experts at MSU who needed hazmat gear to dispose of the 10 foot tall hogweed with leaves as big as five feet covered in little hairs of toxic sap. The public really needs to understand that this is this is not like having a plant that, you know, if it gets out of control, it lowers someone's yield of sugar beets or something. This is really a toxic hazard for family and loved ones. Experts say being exposed to giant hogweed is the equivalent of overdosing on St. John's wart medicine to your skin. And imagine that on the tender skin of a child. We have grandchildren running over all over, small grandchildren over here all the time, and we were very, very concerned. They weren't hurt, but children and pets are especially at risk while they play outside. They just have to brush against it, then expose that skin to sunlight and some type of wetness like sweat or rain. And what this produces is rather disfiguring, unsightly, fluid-filled vesicles of blisters, which unfortunately also pigment the skin. And it takes months to clear up. Then there are scars. Clinical steroids help, but... A modern treatment of this is not as great and efficacious as modern treatment for poison ivy is. But it doesn't always take a hazmat team to kill the plant. Roundup works. You just have to watch out next year. Once they get started, they do need to be followed. In Ovid Township, Shannon Kantner, Fox 47 News. Carrington says hogweed has been seen in Jackson, and he's heard of people selling seeds in Lansing. If, it can, if you do sell it, it can land you in trouble. If you knowingly sell or plant giant hogweed, you can face a federal fine.